the inner voice. You also speak about the inner voice. And there is exactly my question, trusting the inner voice. We are not born and then we are not really taught to listen to it. We are born with these kind of inner voices, but they don't come from, you know, the prefrontal cortex. <laughs> they come from inside, which is perhaps what we call, you know, the soul speaking to you, the divine speaking to you, the energy just wanting to get out. But how do we really a, listen to it and then we really say, like you said, I trust this. I inquired, I got answers, which I heard in the first place, and now I trust I'm on the right path. Right. It, this is a very um, interesting and tricky place to be, which is to kind of be in the space where you're, you're hearing something from within, right? Um, and it takes practice to develop what I call the... the um, the line and channel of communication, right? And to understand that within you lies the, the, the seed of truth. Within you, there is all truth of everything that is in this universe. You've come from this place. You've come from the realm of, of truth, the realm of God, to hear, understanding that you have it all and you have all the answers, right? And so... By looking at those questions and asking the questions, you're opening a channel of communication from within. And it takes practice to open to that and it takes practice to even distinguish what that is from ego or whatever interfering consciousness that exists out there. 